to the swearing-in of Olukayo De Ariwola as the acting chief justice of Nigeria. His appointment was formalized after he took the oath of office monitored by President Muhammad Buhari. But his confirmation as the substantive chief justice of Nigeria is still subject to the Senate's approval. Now, the Nigerian Bar Association is urging the acting chief justice of Nigeria to make judicial reform his first task in office. Femi Akonde reports. I will not look at it. Do solemnly swear that I will be faithful and be a true allegiance to the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Justice Olukayode Ariwola taking the judicial oath as he steps in as the acting chief justice of Nigeria. I will discharge my duties and perform my functions honestly. He takes over from Justice Tanko Mohammed, whose reign was short-lived by his sudden resignation on health grounds. President Mohammed Buhari says history will be kind to Justice Tanko Mohammed for his modest contribution to Nigeria's judiciary the strengthening of democracy and national development. Nigeria's judiciary, under the leadership of Chief Justice of Nigeria, Tanku Mohammed, judiciously exercised the judicial powers of the Federation. But Justice Tanko Mohammed was recently in the eye of a storm when a leaked memo from 14 justices of the Supreme Court accused him of mismanaging funds and neglecting the welfare of judicial officers. There was also pressure mounting on him to step aside and allow for a thorough investigation into allegations made against him. But CJN Tanko Mohammed denied all the allegations in an attempt to clear his name. With the swearing in of the acting CJN, the judiciary will remain under the spotlight. There is no controversy in the Supreme Court. We are one that with the cooperation of my brother justices of the Supreme Court. We shall not fail Nigerians. Justice Ariwola is currently the most senior justice of the Supreme Court. He is currently the 18th justice of the Supreme Court of Nigeria. He was formerly a justice of the Court of Appeal and was elevated to the Supreme Court bench in November 2011, following his transfer from the State High Court in Oyo State. With the exit of Justice Tanko Mohammed, Nigeria's judiciary is expected to chart a new course under the leadership of Justice Olukayode Ariwola. Also, the country will rely heavily on the judicial body, especially in this electioneering period, to help interpret laws guiding the electoral process and settle electoral disputes. Femi Akonde, TVC News, Abuja.